Hey everybody, welcome back to Skyblock Survival on the Fade Cloud server. How's everyone doing today? Hope you're having a fantastic day today. We're in episode number three, guys, and since the last episode, I've done a little bit of work around here. Not, not too much, but I did build an island uh, while you were away. It's a little bit bigger of an island than we originally built uh, last episode, but what's important is, what, is what's on it, and this is an idea that I had. I was wondering how I was going to incorporate diamonds and uh, other blocks like that, maybe even iron and, and things like that into sort of the island level and how we do things. So I figured, you know what, why not make some of these islands not only little rock formations, but also some diamond formations. So this is what I came up with. I'm using some oak. I'm using some diamond. I have this pretty big island right here that I think looks pretty cool. Um, and yeah. Lots of cool things going on here. I'm pretty happy with this island. And I think if we add more islands around this at different levels, because as you can see, this new island is at a, very, at a slightly different elevation from the smaller island. And that's, that's what I kind of want to do with these sorts of islands, have them at many different elevations. Uh, maybe have rope bridges. I haven't really decided about that just yet, but we will see about that. But guys, today's episode is going to be about building islands and expanding our island. Obviously, this is Skyblock. We need to expand our island. But the main thing I want to, I want to do today is actually uh, expand our island probably this way, I'm thinking. Which way is this? Is this east or something? Yes, this is east. Okay. So I, I want to expand our island out east and add ourselves a little bit of a manual tree farm. Because right now, I don't have a tree farm. I have no sort of farm for our trees. And I feel like it's a pretty important thing that we probably want to have pretty close to the center of our island. So uh, especially once we get like birch and, and spruce and whatnot, I want to have a place for those those things to be. And I want to get that started today. And I also want to build probably at least two more of these islands, place them around here. And hopefully at the end of the day, uh, maybe at the end of the episode, if we have time, uh, get these cactus going and get the cactus challenge done. Because if we actually go to challenges, challenges for cactus, we need 32 cactus green dyes, which means we need to smelt 32 cactus. So right now I have six in here. We have two more. I'm, I'm trying to keep these down here so that we can continue to grow cactus as the episode moves along and as I continue uh, with today's episode. Uh, so we'll have eight with that, which means we'll need 24 before we can actually complete that challenge. So we also need a cactus farm eventually. We need a sugarcane farm, all, all kinds of stuff like that. That won't happen today. We definitely need those going forward. So I'll make sure that I get those going uh, sooner rather than later. But guys, we got a lot to do today. We got islands to build. We got expansions to be made. I might even expand. Is this south or north? north i might actually expand north as well a little bit today and see if we can get some stuff going that way i don't know we'll see but yeah guys let me go ahead and get some things together start out with the pathway and i'll see you all with a progress update in just a moment all right work has been done let me show you guys what i've been doing as you can see over here i've been working on the little bit of a tree farming area over here and i have a basic design down that i really like so here we go i extended this pathway this way added some uh, iron bars here and I'm thinking we're gonna use iron bars as sort of like a border around everywhere that we go I couldn't think of a better solution. I tried fences. I tried cobblestone walls It didn't work out too well. So I just I, I just kind of kept that and we'll see what happens But here we are with my design or what I think I'm gonna be doing for uh, Just regular trees like oak trees and birch trees and acacia maybe acacia maybe not acacia uh, But the ones you can put in a row I'm gonna have them ten long and just like this with lights on the outside. Now, my original intention, my original intention, let's see if this works, was to have all of these repeaters set up right here. As you can see, I actually don't know. If you guys know what the rules are about redstone on the server, let me know. I, I tried looking for some. I couldn't, I couldn't, I don't remember finding it. So, uh, <laughs> if I'm not doing anything correctly, uh, please let me know down in the comments below uh, so I don't get in trouble or anything. <laughs> Uh, so why don't we go ahead and do this my original plan was to put a daylight sensor right here I don't think we can actually get daylight sensors on the server. I couldn't find nether quartz, so Sort of what I did <laughs> But the basic premise is so, so we have all this redstone dust going across here And going across the other side over here like this and then we need we need something to power it I was gonna use a daylight sensor so that it would turn off during the day and on overnight, but we may not be able to do that. We'll see. So what I'll use for right now, if we head in here, I'll just grab you. Well, actually, I had this on me. Make ourselves some of you, and we can grab ourselves a lever 
like that. And essentially what this will do, if we power this over right here, it'll turn those lights on. Boom, jack like it. Look, looks pretty cool, right? And we can always come back down here, turn that off or not. Can we not turn it off? Interesting. Um, I thought we could turn that off. So we have to break the circuit in order to turn it off, which that's okay. We'll turn it on for now. I like how that looks. So we can just kind of leave it on. Um, we may not actually need all these repeaters then. We may just go ahead and just use some redstone. Uh, actually, can we power it? Can we even power it with redstone dust? I don't know if we actually can. Believe it or not. I don't know if we actually can. I think those repeaters will work just fine though. Even just turning them on like this uh, works A-OK -okay by me. And I really like how this looks. It lights it up. And if we go ahead and grab ourselves, go over here. Get ourselves some oak saplings. Where are you at? You should be down here. Yeah. Grab ourselves some oak saplings. Place over I, I just think that the redstone lamps make a pretty nice aesthetic around this place. And we'll do that. Actually, we can we can put a trap door right there. Put you down. That's pretty cool. That, that's pretty neat. Uh, and then we had just have this right here. Uh, this is where... This is the one little stretch of our oak saplings in our tree farm. And we'll copy this over on that side. Then I want to have birch and then maybe acacia. And then we'll get into the two by twos over here. Um, but that's sort of the goal. I still have to design a little centerpiece area for around here. Uh, I know possibly in between. No. Yeah, we really just need to add some sort of centerpiece right here uh, that, that goes through the middle. So something that looks pretty good. So hopefully I can sort of work with that moving forward. Uh, but now that we know that this works, not, not the way I, I hoped it would, but it, it does work. Uh, we can go ahead and sort of copy this design going forward uh, and sort of build out from there. And like I said, the center design is the main part that I really need to figure out still. Uh, I think that this looks pretty good. Uh, once we have the iron bars and all that kind of stuff, it's going to look even better in the end. So guys, that's the progress I have for you guys so far. Uh, I have a little more to do. I want to go ahead and copy that on the other side and then get started on the birch stuff. And then we, whenever we come back, I'll get started and hopefully design the center part with you guys uh, so that you guys kind of know my thought process for it. So let me get some work done, guys. I'll see you all in just a moment. Alrighty, so here we are guys. I've done a little bit of progress around here. One major thing I did is down here where we had all these repeaters and redstone. Since what I wanted to do didn't work, I just replaced all that with levers. It's going to be a lot cheaper in the future and it does the same thing. So uh, I have these two platforms already done, these two oak ones. As you can see, they've already started to grow. I'm thinking we may have to put some sort of glass on top of here. Actually, can we go grab some glass? If we have any glass, you don't go there. Do we have any glass? We should. Yeah, there we go. We have just enough. I was thinking with that we'd go ahead and just put some glass like right here. Just over the top of where these things are going to go. It looks great in this clear glass texture pack, by the way. Link is down below if you guys are interested in checking this out. I'm still a huge fan of this thing. Uh, if we go... Is this even 10 long? This is 10 long. Okay. So we should just go out to the edge. Like that. Yeah. Perfect. And this will stop us from getting any of those mega trees. Those are things that we definitely don't want... And they don't really help us out at all. But I already have places over here for more trees. I have a place right here for birch, which I actually don't have a little bit of this on me. Um, but not a whole lot. And what I've, what I've been doing for these glowstone lamps, guys, is I've been going to the slash shop. Because I figure, you know what, most of, it, most of, the, of, the, of the materials I'll get from voting or from grinding on my own. But things like glowstone, which are kind of difficult to get, I figured I might as well just buy here. So we go ahead and buy 45 glowstone for an X amount of money. And then what I do is I go over here. I grab some redstone, if we have any. Yeah, we have some right there, uh, which I actually need to make a generator and probably grind for that a little bit more uh, and go ahead and make ourselves some of what what is happening. I don't, I, what, you don't, you don't belong there. <laughs> what are you doing? Um, let's go ahead and do that. That should be plenty. Glowstone, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Grab you. I don't have any levers on me either, do I? Yeah, I've basically just been buying the glowstone and then using the redstone. Because actually, if we go to the shop... Can I go to the shop real quick? If we go to the shop, you... Can you... I don't think you can buy redstone lamps. I, I didn't actually see that you could buy them. But either way, it's still a lot cheaper. It would be a lot cheaper to just... You can't get it here? Interesting. Um, 
yeah, either way, it, was, it would still be cheaper just to craft them on my own uh, and then bring them over here. And essentially, all I do is just place them right here. Row of 10 and a row of 10. And this, sh this should be plenty, honestly, to finish up with the acacia and with the birch here. Because this right here is going to be birch. I had thought about replacing this oak right here with birch once we get birch. Um, to kind of symbolize, like, this is where birch trees are. And, you know, this is where this tree are. And this is where that tree is. And stuff like that. Um, my color coordinating things might prove to be beneficial. I don't know if I actually want to do that moving forward. But that's just a thought that I had. That's the setup that would be for the birch trees. And if we grab ourselves some levers. I thought I had levers. I got levers, didn't I? Those are redstone repeaters right there. Okay. They blend in with the torches so well. It's a pretty interesting thing to think about. Is what what items, what objects in this game actually blend in with, with other objects. Well, uh, that's kind of the basis of building. And that's kind of the basis of a lot of things in this game, actually. Uh, that, that look appealing and... Um, and whatnot, but go ahead and do this. Like, like, like you can see, super easy, nothing major. Uh, and then once we get birch saplings, we'll place those there. And once we get acacia, we'll place these here. But I want to work on right now. I want to work on this because obviously we we want to incorporate a lot of gold into this build, but we also want to incorporate the same design, the same sort of design that we have over here. So I'm going to go ahead and make myself some slabs. I want to incorporate some as as many uh, of the building blocks that we used in this main island as I possibly can. So we're going to use some slabs, we're going to use some stone brick stairs, we're going to use a whole bunch of things, and we're going to try and see if we can come up with a design for this. Ooh, this is... We actually want to go ahead and move you, I think. We'll take you and you, and we'll move you to the sides, I think. Yeah, that'll work a lot better. And then I was thinking for the sides here, up you go, slab, 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 slab. And on that side would be probably, no? Yeah. Slab, maybe just straight slabs for now until we get something better. Just actually just fill that in. For now, I think that'll work out just fine. And then I was thinking we'd put stairs. Well, first off, we need something in the middle here. Uh, I'm thinking we might just use some... We haven't used stone brick, have we? Let's just use regular stone brick. See how that works. Because I haven't used that yet. Use you there. And just put the stone brick stairs, stone brick stairs. Off of there, stone brick. Off of there, stone brick. Building's a process, guys. Bear with me. <laughs> something right there. Something right here, and then oh nope that yeah no that's right that's right that's right I'm not I'm not dumb <laughs> I know what I'm doing it's fine something like that and something like that and actually right here we want to have a stair as well I think to kind of blend in with the pathway so that's the basis of this design but what I actually want I actually want to take get rid of you because I want this thing to flow going from here to the outside going all the way down or flow as best as we can so i definitely want to incorporate some oak in here as well let's go ahead and make some oak running down the middle right here we'll mix other things in there shortly something like that i'm thinking we might actually hmm hmm yeah we, we want to get rid of you that doesn't mesh well with what i was going for so we want to get rid of you i think uh and we want to go ahead keep the oak going yeah, we'll just we'll we'll run the oak all the way down, I think, like this, because um, that that'll maintain sort of a, a center structure, a center pathway that we can sort of work with going forward. Uh, I think I want to move remove that, get myself, I need to make some slabs real quick. <laughs> make a few slabs, right? Slabs here, slabs here. I definitely want to re replace you with that and i want to replace you with this as well and i think i want to add a few stairs right here as well to kind of keep with the stair theme that we have going on right here so add you add you does that work that's not a bad design i don't like all the oak in here i think the oak is a bit eh right now but that is not a bad design we could just continue with the design that we had before actually you know what i want to do we need to remove you and replace you with that. 
Yeah, it's going to be a lot better. I think I want to continue with the design that we had before and see if this mes meshes in well. Uh, do that, 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 and that. And will this work the way I want it to? Let's go make ourselves some more stairs. I think this is going to work out, guys. I think this, this is going to work out pretty well. Uh, what I might actually want to do... I think I, think I want to get rid of you... Cause this is what's we need to we need to break things up somewhere. I think we're gonna break things up right there. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. It's not bad at all. Of course, we gotta continue that on the outside. I'm really loving the gold theme that we're going with, guys. I absolutely love this gold theme. I think it works out really well for what we are doing. So I actually want to. This is the issue with using slabs, right? <laughs> Kids don't use slabs. It's a bad idea. No, it's you, you can use slabs, but in, in a sky block, it becomes hard to to deal with at times. And that is the basic design moving forward. I like that design. I like it. I think it looks pretty cool. It adds the amount of division that we need between spaces. Once we get the, these little bits going in, I think it's gonna work out pretty well. And at the end of the day, this is this is looking good, guys. This is looking really, 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 really good. I'm liking it. I'm liking our design. I'm liking what what we're doing here, and I think this place is progressing pretty darn well. Is that a mega tree? Is that a mega tree? Please don't tell me that this is a mega tree. I think it is. Oh, that sucks. I have to get rid of these anyways and add glass and stuff. That'll be fine though. Anyways, guys, let me go ahead and work on this area a little bit more so I can get this design kind of down packed and ready to go. I think it starts over here. Yeah, it starts over there as well. We're going with basically the same design for the pathways all, all the way around. And these work well for borders, so I'm pretty happy I'm pretty happy about that, to be honest. <laughs> but yeah, guys, let me go ahead and get back to work doing some more stuff and things. And, we, and I will be back with you all with a progress update in just a moment. Last two. We have two more vote crates. Let's see. We got an epic crate? Two epic crates? I won't open those as well. I haven't opened any of those in a while. And another vote crate. Oh, I guess we're opening more crates. Went from two to three. That's pretty cool. Lots of emeralds and lots of chest plates. So that, that's actually pretty cool. Now, what are in these epic crates? I haven't opened these in a while. Epic leggings, emeralds, gold. Cool, cool. What's over here? Iron, epic helm, XP. Okay. So most of the stuff in those crates are like armor and like emeralds and, and valuables like that, which is pretty cool. They help us in the long run. So I'm pretty... Happy with that sort of stuff. Let's put all that stuff away. Just put all of you away. But guys, I've been working a little bit on the islands off camera. As you can see, I've gotten some things done over here. I got all that stuff done. I have this little pathway spread out. And even spread out, I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, I think we, we probably want to add one more section before we go down. My plan is to then go down from here and then make the tall trees from there. Uh, which is probably what we're going to do pretty soon. Maybe even next episode. Uh, but a few other things that I've done over here, as you can see, I made a few modifications. So what I decided to do is because I noticed at night that these things are pretty dark. So I decided, you know what, let's buy some glowstone, let's get some trapdoors, and let's see how this looks. And I think it looks pretty good. I think it actually adds a little bit of texture to the island, which is which is pretty rad in my opinion. Uh, and I added, I think, four in total. One, two, three, four, something like that. I think I added four. Is that four or is that three? Might, might only be three, actually. Yeah, it might only be three. Anyways, <laughs> the point is, I added some of that glowstone over here to add some lighting to the area, and I'm thinking about doing the same thing over to this one, although it'd be obviously less than at this bigger island over here uh, and all that good stuff. And another, the last thing I wanted, I wanted to do today, guys, I wanted to do to complete the challenge for cactus but we only have 19 cactus so sadly i won't be able sadly i won't be able to end today's episode with that but look forward to that next episode next episode we'll definitely be completing that challenge we'll have all the necessary things uh, that we need for that and one last thing i want to do slash is level see where we're at we are at level 96 for our island which is super duper awesome really happy with that uh, pretty pretty awesome island so far. We've been adding a lot of blocks that I like. Uh, we've been adding a lot of variation. And I think when when this thing is done, I, I, I want to add a few more islands. Like I want to add some more of these things down lower and higher and all over the places where I want these little floating islands to be. So hopefully hopefully it'll be pretty cool uh, to look at once it's all done. I think you guys will enjoy it.
But guys, that is actually going to end things for me today. I'm running out of time. But if you guys did enjoy the video, go ahead, smash that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel if you're new and or not already is subscribed. Anyways, guys, take care, and I'll see you later.